Welcome back to How to Authority. On your Samsung device, like this S23 Ultra, there's plenty of ways so you can take a screenshot. So today, let's go over all of the easiest ones that you should be using. By far the easiest method is to use the two hardware buttons on the side, the volume and power one. Just hold them down at the same time, and as you can see, it takes a screenshot, which is going to be saved with the rest of your photos. However, there's also a couple of other methods of doing it. Probably the most fun one, if not the most useful, is by just simply having your hand go across the screen, kind of like a scanner, which is what it's supposed to kind of represent. And then as you saw, it also takes a screenshot that way. It's, it's a bit funky, but it's kind of cool at the same time. Or if you have Bixby enabled, you can just ask it instead. Take a screenshot. With Android, there's one more cool feature when it comes to screenshots that you should probably be aware of. If there's something that's just too big to fit on the screen at once, like if I wanna, you know, just capture a bunch of my Twitter timeline right here, I can first take a screenshot like I normally would and then click on this icon in the bottom, which will basically make a scroll screenshot, basically taking a bunch of hidden stuff underneath in the app you currently have open and adding that to the screenshot as well, making nice long screenshots of whatever you need. So as you can see, there's plenty of ways of taking screenshots on Android and specifically on Samsung devices. So if this was helpful, make sure to subscribe to How to Authority for more like this in the future.